This is the final video on improper integrals. You will find this on page 342 in the Namibia AES level mathematics textbook y equals mx plus c to success. Let's look at the final example. The diagram shows part of the curve, here's the function, show that as k strive to infinity, okay, the shaded region tends to a finite value and find that that value this value okay so the area it's going to be between k and zero this is the function dx okay so we're going to just leave it k and zero we're going to get it ready for integration by taking this up and it becomes negative two don't forget your rule what is it in front it's a two that's why i multiply with one over two it's the rule a x plus yeah plus e to the power e. Okay, so that is the rule that we are going to follow. So basically, I'm going to integrate. There, I integrate it, and then I add and I divide, and I'm getting. So this is negative one, and so it becomes negative. But if I divide by that two, it's there is with with that thing. Do you see there? Okay. Now I'm going to substitute, but don't forget, after I substitute, I see that k is striving to infinity. Okay, now can I just show you, why is, I, I just showed you that part, but can I just show it here? So say you have negative 10, and you have 2, and you have infinity plus 5. If you multiply with infinity, it's infinity. If you add inf uh, 5 to infinity, it's infinity. And that's why I said negative 10 to infinity. And you can again go to that table to show that um, to you, the infinite table. Okay, so, but then, can you remember, as soon as you divide by infinity, it's the only time that it becomes zero. In the table and because it became zero I can add two and what is that value so k is the shaded area tends to a finite value of two okay I want you to stop the video and I want you to do try now 50 and I want you to do number one again you can continue the video as soon as you are finished number one Okay, what is my function? Where is my function? And if I still want to, oh, that two is not looking nice. Um, it's a square root, two minus x. Okay. And if I still want to, I can write it as three, bring it up, two minus x to the power negative of all. Okay, I didn't write it into integration yet. The diagram shows part of this. Show that if k is striving now to 2, the shaded tends to a value. Oh, I'm telling you the value. 6 and square root 2. Okay, so the area will be, and what will it be? k and 0. This is my function. Okay, so I'm going to integrate. Remember, there's a 1, so it's negative 1. So it's going to be 3, that's just a constant. It's up, multiply 1 over negative 1. You can put it at the back or here, it doesn't matter. And then it's 2 minus x. And as soon as it's you add 1, so it's just a half. And don't forget that that same half you're going to divide with. And then it's going to be, oh, sorry, not 4, but k. Okay, can do that. K and zero. Okay, so if I multiply, this is going to be, can you see? It's going to be 2 over 1, so that if you multiply it with the 3, it's going to be 6, multiply with the negative. So this is just going to give you negative 6, um, and, and you can take it back to the root there. I prefer taking it sometimes just back to the root. 
Okay. And now I can substitute. And if I substitute, I'm just going to get negative 6, 2 minus k, minus, I don't have to put, make it smaller. Oh, I want to make it smaller. I don't have to put that bracket again. Okay, so it's negative 6 to minus 0. Okay, so let's just, this is negative 6. I have to leave this, 2 minus k. Uh, let's just get this one. So this is going to become a positive, and this is 6, and this is square root 2. Okay, but now I am going to say as, and I'm using that, k is driving to 2. I'm just going to substitute there negative 6, 2 minus 2, which is, okay, I can, I can even put the whole step. Um, I just, I'm going to put the whole step. Because that's going to, that's 0, so that is going to be 0 plus 6 square root 2, which, which they gave me there. So I can end off, off by saying, hinge as k is striving to do the shaded area tends to uh, net value of 6 square root 2 and that's how you do it. I don't think this number 2 will be so difficult just see that it's now going to 0 here.